And now to a somber day of remembrance. Today actually marks one year since a two-year-old boy's life was cut tragically short at a Disney resort. Yeah, the toddler died last June after a gator dragged him into the water. News 6 reporter Sashel Saunders takes a look at the symbol Disney is installing in his honor. Both family members of Lane Graves and Disney are keeping quiet about that tragedy one year ago, but the announcement shows that his death still impacts today. One year later and two-year-old Lane Thomas Graves' light will continue to shine bright with a tribute from Disney. That was his family's hope when an unimaginable tragedy literally ripped the toddler from their lives. The family was playing near the Seven Seas Lagoon at Disney's Grand Floridian Resort. Lane was scooping sand from a man-made beach when an alligator jumped from the water, pulling him in. His dad tried fighting the gator. It was hours before they'd find Lane's body. Now Disney says they will build a lighthouse sculpture, much like the one used as a logo for the foundation created in the toddler's name. Disney said in a statement that the sculpture will be, quote, a symbol of love and hope. The theme park also made other changes after Lane's death, adding warning signs about alligators and creating a wall of large rocks along the lagoon to keep people away. The family acknowledged the traumatic accident in a statement as well, calling their son beautiful and continued, for now, we choose to continue to live quietly with no current desire to speak publicly. The lighthouse sculpture will be installed later this summer. Disney has not said if they will have a public unveiling of it. Reporting at Disney, Sashel Saunders, News 6.